Yo, what's up? This your boy Black Truth. I'm back. All right, today we're going to do a review. We're going to do a review of a movie. And I'm not going to tell you the name of the movie. I'm just going to let you see it. Let's get right into it. There was a two-second clip of a black man on the horse. And that man is my great-great-grandfather. Great. There's another great-grandfather. But that's why back at the Haywood Ranch, as the only black-owned horse trainers in Hollywood, we like to say since the moment pictures could move, yeah, skin of the game. Man, she is so beautiful. That's a beautiful young lady right there. Her name is Kiki Palmer. Y'all know Kiki Palmer. And name uh, the name of her a character in this movie, nope, is called Emerald Haywood. Okay. Man, she's funny too, by the way. This guy right here. His name is Daniel Kaluuya. He played in um he played in a few movies. Uh, I think the movie that I best liked him in uh, was Black Panther. That was one of the movies I liked him in, but I liked him in a few different movies. Uh, it was another movie he played in that was really really good. I think it was um Queen and Slim. Yeah, yeah, I like that movie too. Um, some of the other actors that's going to be in this movie um, is Steven Yun, Barbie Ferreira, Brandon Perra, Michael Wilk Wincott, Mark Casimir, Donna Mills, to name a few. But let's get back into this review. Now, this is a horror thriller movie. So, I'm telling you, when I first saw this uh, clip, man, I was like, wow. And, um, by the way, let me let you know, Jordan Peele is the guy who created this film. And some of the best movies I've seen came from Jordan Peele. And, you know, he came from, um, I don't know, I think it was Nickelodeon with Key and Peele. But anyway, um, the last two movies I saw of him was... One of the movies was called um, Us, which was a pretty good movie. And then um, Get Out. Get Out was a great movie. Uh, great. Uh, Get Out had so many different um, hidden messages and meanings. Anything from organ harvesting to um, trusting um, people that you think you could trust, but you really can't. So it's a lot of hidden messages in his movie so when i saw the trailer to this movie i was like okay here we go again he's trying to tell us something Man, it's, it's now what the hell is that it's like looks like a car with lights but there's no road. The fuck? Oh. Oh, the horse dipped on him. What's a bad miracle? And I've noticed that they're always looking up in this um in this movie, in this trailer, man. I can't wait till this movie comes out too, man. But they're always looking up for some reason. And then I, I saw this, it's like, what, y'all trying to give a sacrifice to something? Like, what's going on? They got work for that. Oh. Yeah. Wow, what is that? Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, damn, that looked like an alien that was coming around that corner. What the fuck? Oh, wow. Yeah, no. So this is going to be a movie about aliens and spaceships. Now, y'all go back. Man, Donald J. Trump, he came in office. He said he was going to divulge if there were aliens or not on this planet and in this universe. And our government did 
bring some files out saying that they did have secrets of UFOs. So, what the hell? Uh, no, no. <laughs> All the air just pushing out of the place. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow. Nope. I think that's going to be a really good movie um, with actor Daniel Kaluuya and Kiki Palmer headlining those actors and actresses. Man, I think y'all really need to go out and check that movie out. It's from the director, Jordan Peele. Um, it's coming out 7-22-22, and I will definitely be there, man. I don't know if it's all about aliens. I don't know if it's about black aliens. But one thing you can know for sure, that Jordan Peele will have some type of spin on this movie to leave you. When you walk out of that movie theater, you're going to be like, oh, damn. But yeah, man, thank y'all for coming. It's your boy, Black Truth, man. Peace.